what's going on YouTube? I go by the name Declined. Hope you guys enjoyed that intro montage. Uh, so I've been sniping in Call of Duty for over 13 years now, a little over. Yes, I'm an old head and I still play video games, but I love Call of Duty and they tell you to do something that you love, so who cares what anybody thinks? Anyway, let's get into it. So I'm going to be teaching you guys some little, you know, little secrets that the pros use, but they don't explain in depth on how really to be consistent in Call of Duty sniping. So I'm going to make like a little, uh, you know, tutorial, a bunch of tutorial videos throughout the next like month or two. And I'm going to go over in depth on how you can become a more consistent and more aggro sniper. If you are new, definitely sub to the channel. It would be greatly appreciated. And you will learn some new things, I, I hope. I mean, I'm not doing this for my health. I really do want to, you know, help you guys learn and become the best that you can be. Because nobody helped me out with sniping, so... It's all, all from learning over the years. Probably watch thousands of hours over the years, you know. But anyway, let's get into it. So when you are no scoping, you want to be centering. If you don't know what centering is, centering is that little crosshair that's in the middle of your screen. You want to put that where the enemy is going to be coming through. So if you think they're going to be coming down this little alley, then you want to center the crosshair down an alley. So, for example, in this no scope, you'll see that the enemy has his back turned towards me. So I wait for the bloom to settle. For those who don't know, the bloom is just the crosshair, and the bullet can go anywhere in between that crosshair. Now, like I said, your bullet will go anywhere in that bloom. So it's nice to have a small, uh, small bloom, the smallest as possible as you can. To let it settle, so like you, you think of it as like a hip fire quick scope when it's, it's it, like you're running and then it spreads open and then you stop for a second and then it settles. You can no scope like a quick scope kind of just make sure that the enemy's you know name name tag on the screen pops up because that that's like your key. You know I'm good to go. Now in hardcore, it doesn't really matter where you line it up because like. Hey, markers are not a thing with marksmen or snipers, so you're good on that. But in core, you you, you want to preferably, you know, aim towards the head. You want to aim for the shoulders or above because that increases your chances of actually successfully killing them in one shot and not just getting a hit marker like everybody complains about in this game. But that's, that's my little tip and trick for this secret Call of Duty, how to no-scope like a pro. If you guys did learn something, please go ahead, drop a follow, sub, and then hit that bell notification because I will be doing more videos like this on, you know, get more in depth on how to snipe. Um, thanks for stopping by, guys. Hope you guys have a wonderful night and peace.